subscribe to Niger's Places. Press the bell icon and never miss another video update. Hello guys, welcome to this FS code. On this FS code, we want to take a look at the uh, sixty thousand dollar apology. Oh, well, that's a that's a very expensive apology. If you if you calculation the money. Hmm. For a uh, book up for something, for something, almost twenty eight million, twenty eight million. million. Hey, twenty eight million. See, million. Apolo that's a fantastic apology. Ah, I'm just thinking if they want to beg you now to mm. say collect that kind of money to stop talking about to speak the truth because the way you have been saying all this way, you know, see money. Mm. Nobody did support you. Mm. You've been shouting since money. Since uh, for six years now. Now nah, we've been shouting. Nobody they give any support. Missed. If somebody now come out of those shamatans, mm. they now say, oh, we we'll give you 50 million naira. Don't lie. Mm. If I was seeing you say the truth, what will you do? Hmm. Let's see 20 million. Uh, what will you do? 20 million will be hard. I will not, um, I will not consent con accept 20 million. What about 50 million? 50 million. Once. Bah! It's tempting. Hmm. It's very tempting. I'm not lying. I'm only human. Hmm. But at the end of the day, I know that my integrity is for sale. Hmm. Uh, my integrity is for sale. If if he can make it like a one billion. Oh, the boy just <laughs> sell your integrity for high money. High money. Yes, now you cannot be selling your money. If if at least if if I sell it for one billion now and people come online, they mm. cost me and cost me and cost me. We need to pay me. If I hear, you may be saying. Jay is red. That is banker, banker up and down now. He no care. He don't even see come by. Then they do. Is is that people are still loving him. So sell so, it. Me, I will sell it and I will come here and say that they gave me money. Mm. And I did I accepted. I will come here and say it. That and tell it. them reason. And yes, because, because you have been begging for support, no single somebody. If they give me one billion, hey, mm. I will come online here. Yeah, I will use my own mouth to confess that I collected one billion. You will, I will not lie. You will do give away. I will do give away. So we go say top fans. <laughs> you have been watching our video for you give them fat better better cat. But let me leave the light yeah. just a story for you mm. know. We're just trying to play around. Yeah, we were playing around. I don't mind us, so we will no. not collect. So the truth is uh, <laughs> we, we will not collect. Hmm? Mm -mm. When they bring one billion, we will not. It you think anybody will give you one billion? Oh, you are deceiving yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you are deceiving how much they have. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay, now we want to let's be, let's get serious. Okay, we want to talk about the um, uh, Apostle Suleiman and um, uh, uh, Pastor Mike Davids. This issue has been raging on people have been people have been calling us out that we talked about the video. We don't know if he's in duress or if his life is is in danger. That's why he made that video. And uh, we are we are saying that we we made a video we saw online. We don't know the background, but we want to thank Solomon for bringing out. Yes. the background of what happened so this is a conversation between solomon and the apostle mike davis huh? who give a post to mike david is it oh sorry pastor sorry p david p mike davis p mm -hmm. because he's not even a pastor mm -hmm. uh, let's go so shout out to solomon young is his thank you his name Isang. is Isang. solomon bizang bizang eh? bansham sabi eh bizang bansham i do that's where you are going yeah mm. are you me? uh yes i can hear you good morning seems like you just woke up from sleep hello yeah did you just wake up from sleep no not quite that was in my study okay how are you? By his grace. By grace. Good. You said you were going to make a video yesterday. Yeah, between that yesterday to now, I have been having um, some kind of uh, serious frictions with my family. They don't want you, you know? to make the video to clear your name? Or they are trying to... The position they are, they are, they are standing on is that 
the video that went out is not about retraction. Are you with me? Yes. That the, that the video, that there are two videos that they saw. Okay. That the first one, that the first one was very clear that, um, uh, what do you call it, that um, I was on a spiritual sojourn and I had directions from the Lord. And uh, certainly because of well-meaning Nigerians and church leaders who intervened, that uh, I was willing to give peace a chance and all of that. That as far as they are concerned, it's, um, it's and that I also talked about amicable resolution. And that as far as they are concerned, that even as Christians, no matter the disagreements, we must come to terms of resolution. And that they don't see how that video affects me in any way. That people, of course, will uh, have their opinions on the issue. And that secondly, it is clear from all indications in those videos that I was under duress to do those videos. I didn't do it on my own free will. But people but don't know. Are... People don't know that. Mm. I mean, I understand you have to work with family. First, mm. you said you were adopted, abducted in Abuja, right? Mm. Mm -hmm. Did you tell them exactly what happened? They are aware. So you, how, did you, there, there how did you tell them? How did you tell them? In summary, how did you tell no, them what I, happened? No, I told them that everything that happened now, how I was, you know. This guy is a liar. A big liar. He's trying to say that he was ad abducted. His mm. story is conflicting. And now, he's saying that he, he, now from the way he's talking, you know he did not mm. tell his family. I told them now. Mm. I told them yeah, that, uh, yeah. that, uh, yeah, that I was abducted. What kind of what kind of nonsense lie is that? Yeah. You came online, you told us that you are you are in a spiritual soldier and God told you. Mm. So you are lying. All of you see what we are saying. You came we, to lie on we God. We said it in the video hey. now that that is a lie that he's just lying that you were uh, God told him. We, 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 okay, God we said told the other you. that he collected money. Go and check the video again. Now you don't. Watch now, I'm let's compelled, you know, using force and all of that to do that video. They said they understand that what they are saying is not, you know, whether or not I was compelled. That even from the videos, everybody can see that clearly. You get my point? So, did that you, something did, is not right. Did you that what they are saying is that I should just let the issue rest and move on with my life? Since he was even willing in the first place. To consider terms of uh, resolution and all of that, that I should let it go. But, the, blah, 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 but, blah, but no. wait, so consider terms of resolution. You should let it go. You accuse him of collecting your wife. Right. You accuse him of collecting your children. Now you will let it go. Hmm. Let it go because he will bring your wife to you, or he will stop sleeping with your wife, or he will tell your children to call you father. I don't understand this whole story. This man is just a confused idiot. I told you. Listen. But Mike, do you want to stand for the truth? Do you think that is the right thing to do? If you want to stand for the that truth, that is the right thing. To, that is the right thing to do. So you but were, you were, but but look I at it. To do. You were adopted. You told you told me you were adopted in Abuja. Car just came and you were arrested and you were taken to a hidden place. I ask you if you were beaten or you were, you know, anything was done to you physically. No, but then they made a video. Now you made a video for them apologizing for the way you handle things yes i understood you didn't apologize for uh what you said i understand that and then after making a video for them you told me they now give you they now gave you fifty thousand dollars now where is the fifty thousand sixty thousand dollars right yes where is the money now again the money is not with you at the time Where's the it's money? My lawyer, and I've told them to return the money. You know, so they are still driving. This one is light that will kill you. You boy not. <laughs> You're a thief. You're a pastor thief. Oh, so you gave the money to your attorney and told them to return the money. Wait, okay. Anthony, Naimi, na brother. Mm -mm. Attorney. He's a ah. lawyer. How ah, Anthony be resemble lawyer? No, you are different for Anthony and not Anthony. Everybody, anybody is a name of a human being, of a male They didn't say Anthony. They say Anthony. Eh, maybe they don't want to pronounce it in a probable way. Anthony is different for a lawyer. 
If you give it to your lawyer, say you give it to your lawyer. We are Tony. Who is a Tony? Is he his younger brother? Anyways, he gave the money to his lawyer. Okay. To return. That's what he's saying. That one I like. Money that I is. I like Nigeria. Most especially, I respect Nigeria. Okay, now. Nah. He's saying that they coerced him, they kidnapped him, they did this one. His lawyer did not say anything that they kidnapped him. The lawyer did not come out to say, oh, I'm suing Apostle Suleiman for threatening my client and arresting my client and forcing my client to record yeah. a video under duress. That one is not a crime. But duress, maybe. It's not condom. Don't start to. Mm -hmm. You have started doing an apple cool. They say trust. It's a trust condom. It's duress. Duress. Okay. Not durex. Okay. Okay. I don't know with due respect. I don't know duress with due respect. Okay. I don't know. Is that, what, uh, is that what I said? Uh, duress. That will be You have to say it in the syllabulous way. That with due respect. Duress. Thank you. Continue. Anyways, the lawyer did not come out to say that, oh, they beat my clients, mm -hmm. they did this to my yeah. client, mm -mm. but it's just time to give them money. The lawyer did not make a video to say, oh, they gave us money. If Solomon had not called him, nobody mm -hmm. would hear anything yes. about, oh, they gave me Solomon money. Solomon said he heard it from, from outside before he now contacted yeah. him. He has been dodging Solomon because... And this was Solomon that started this whole thing to help him. He was he's the only person that interviewed him like... Now, when you now went behind and collecting money, Nobody. Oh, back. You say you are giving money, to the yeah. money that you have spent. Dragging because what they are trying to do is that um, number one, the money that was given to me was not for the issue that I raised. It was basically for what do you call it um, for the sixteen years of my service to the ministry. Are you get what I'm saying? Yes. See that. So the so, so so now the money is for his services for sixteen, 16 years. years. Sixty thousand dollars, sixteen years service. Wow! What a fantastic coincidence that they abducted you mm. to pay you for your services. You can see that you are a confused. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, good. They abducted you, took you to a secluded law police to pay you for your services to the <laughs> ministry. You can see how people can lie. See, you, you will not blame him. He learns from the best to oh, the, the best. best. Uh, <laughs> see, listen, mm. the truth is uh, I know they had a discussion. Mm. I think this guy, as Solomon has said, he went behind mm. to discuss resolution mm. by them to send money. Mm. And that is bribery. That's bribery. That's bribery. Let's call it what it is. It is what it is. It, it did what it is. Mm, did it, what it is. Did this what it is. I said it is what it is. Did this what it Let's is. Let's continue. I told uh, them that I don't need the money. Because when I came out, because my lawyer told them that from the outset of this issue, money was never the intention. Are you getting what I'm saying? Yes. Uh, money, was, money was never my intention. I didn't ask them for money, for no money. All I came out for was for my family to be returned to me. So now and your family was not now, returned to you, uh, as, and money was given no, to you. No, no, no. Listen, you know, as for my wife, is my wife. She has clearly stood her ground. Are you with me? She has clearly stood her ground that she does not want the marriage anymore. As we speak, I get you. So. Uh, you, you see, the, the most difficult part is, the most difficult part now is, you were given money, right? Mm -hmm. And there was, I was told that you were given money, even before you told me you were given money, right? Mm -hmm. I was told you were given money and promised the Canadian passport, even before you told me you were given money. So the fact that no. you were giving money, I didn't hear it from you for the first time. I had it from another right. source for the first time. Now there's this guy, Darlington, who's been coming to me, yeah. trying to pretend, talking to you and then coming to me, who is the chief negotiator, who you told me was the guy that led, led the abduction. You're right? And he sent me a message telling me that you are the one actually who invited him to Abuja to help 
broker the deal to help bring peace and bring reconciliation so now i'm confused you were telling me he was the guy that came and abducted you on part of the team and gave you sixty thousand dollars and now you are telling me and now he's telling me no he wasn't part of that he, he didn't know anything about that abduction are uh, you at the one he even i have a, a message that was between the two of you he said he was going to canada but then he had to he had to wait and postponed because you wanted him to come to abuja hold on hold on it's i'm coming to get the spider hold on you know so now the whole thing for me is confusing mike you have to remember if you didn't put this out you wouldn't have gotten the support and the response from them so because you put it out you made videos you came to platforms like mine other people believed in your story and now it went out that was why you received this support and at least there is some sort of uh, whatever sort of uh, reconciliation you have between them people deserve to know what happened your family cannot tell you your family was not there your family was not the one that advised you to put things out they were not there when people were on social media people were putting pressure and talking about omega fire and suleiman that was why they had to cool down so now you are telling me that you don't want to to talk to people you don't want to re re respond to people because of your family because peace was reconciled to, to be honest with you i don't buy story that, that story and i would not agree with that story and now it would be difficult for me to even agree with the fact that you they, they gave you sixty thousand and dollars and then you gave it to your uh, attorney and you want to return the, the money how are we going to know that you return the money when, if you did return the money how are we gonna know that you're not gonna keep the money how are we not gonna believe the upside of the story where you're saying you were doing it for money in the first place because you were broke and everything how are we not gonna believe that you see the complication and what is truth truth people deserve to know whether your family has another opinion you have to tell them you have to respect my opinion because if you, your reputation is finished if you say something or if it is if you don't say something you know and the fact that going into the future before god there's nothing like truth there what your family is telling you to do for me and i would speak for many others that's not the right way to handle it that's incomplete yes if you guys reconcile fine but you need to tell people the truth because what we're going to see now from you is you're just going to keep quiet forever you're not going to talk about it We've seen a lot of other cases like that. I've seen a lot of other cases, people that will come to me and use my platform to, 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 to create awareness and to put pressure on whoever and they will get paid and they keep quiet and they will never talk. They will keep saying, ah, well, but this, ah, well, but this. Brother, this was not about you. Now you're making it just about you alone. If it was just about you, you wouldn't have put this thing out there for everybody to see and to know. You know what I'm looking at, right? Before you send me this message, I was just about to go for a meeting. What I'm what I'm looking at doing is um um when I finish what you have what we have said now is more like a, a counsel or what you feel about the matter or what you feel is best to do. Alright, so what I'm looking at is probably to grant an interview through your platform. Are you getting what I'm saying? I'm, you listen, what I'm, I'm, saying? I'm listening to you, yes. So to grab an interview through your platform to let the world know what eventually happened about the resolution. All right? So when I'm, when I'm finished with my meeting, I'll give you a call back and I'll let you know how to go about that. Well, when, when do you intend to let people know? No, as, as soon as possible. It's not something I intend to delay now. It has to be like urgent now people are asking questions people are even getting tired you know we know we told you solomon mike is one of those guys he just used you he just came out because he needed money now he's now you were telling me he's been paid sixty thousand dollars how are you even going to make sure you you give proof to people that you return that money right suleiman is not going to come out and say he gave you money Mm -hmm. No. It's not a problem. You know, I told ah, you I have. There's questions. a lot of complication here, Mike. And if you are in ministry, and if you're not transparent and honest and accountable, forget about ministry. Go look for another job. No, definitely. It's not a problem. When I finish, I will give you a call back, then we'll know what to do. 
Hello? Okay, okay. I would hear from you then. I'll give you a call. Please, let's do this as soon as possible. Whether it's my platform or not my platform, for me, people need to know, you didn't just come to me as somebody who is a YouTuber and a Christian journalist. No. You came to me as a brother. You came to me as another, you know, a uh, 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 council. You came to me as somebody who you believe is going to be objective. And I'm trying to be as objective as possible. When I shared your story, I tried to be as objective as possible. Now is your chance to, to tell people the truth. You need to be as objective as possible. If not, no. you know, if we don't do this in the next 24 hours or whatever, to be honest with you, I'm done with this. And I'll just, I'm just going to fold my arms and I'm just going to, and I'm going to believe the first thing I was told. Mike negotiated. He was paid $60,000 to release that video. And that was the end of it. As simple as that. That's going that's just going to be what I'm going to believe because there's no any other thing I'm going to believe. There's no need to believe that. I will revert to you. I'll wait and hear from you then. Alright, thanks. Oh, he, he did it. Yeah. So, I felt listening to this audio again, I feel disappointed in Mike because he is a chronic liar. I'm giving you my conclusion now. He is a as corrupt as Suleiman, for him to sit down and cook this story up, this story that he cooks up, he cooked up that doesn't even really, is isn't even really. <laughs> so after you know that, because it's, it did not get back to him, it did not get yeah. back to Suleiman. You see, yeah. you can tell a liar from the way they talk. What he wanted to do to Solomon then, Solomon, let me tell you, what he did to you is called discharging. You're in Nigeria now, you know now. Hmm. Oh, I have a meeting, I have a meeting. Hmm. I, will, I will call you back immediately to put a life. Nah, nah, so people when they promise <laughs> someone, they tell you one hour time. One hour time. time. Two years. In Two America. years. Liars, man. This guy is a chronic liar. He came out because he was broke. Huh. Made all that noise. Okay, when I knew it was a lie, my dad I said, if I supposed to say a man don't tell, I'm giving him two weeks. Mm, if I, will, I, will I will reveal release, some, some I will secrets. Re two weeks pass, Baba. No secrets. She come. And now they don't give her money. They are not even giving him money. That was even before, before. that apology video where it was looking like somebody that life has tired. Mm. This man is a hungry man. He's a hungry man. He knows that he can get something from Suleiman. He knows, even though he has the story, hey, wait. but the aim of everything is to it's get that something. money. Wait, wait, wait. Let's let's say the truth. Or I do. Let's just try pick mm. this point. Mm. Everything he said that happened to him and his family. Mm. Are there? Truth in that. There is truth. In there it. is truth. Mm. But the motive, the motive, and congestive, is the, digestive. Uh, hey, the motive and, agree. and digest. No, not the other digestive. The, you don't know this English. Just continue what you're saying. The motive and digestive of this OT is for him to, to collect give him money. money. So now, are we saying that Suleiman bribe? This man, isn't that what he said? Uh, do I need to say it? No, it's a question. Hey, it's but he has bad. already said it that they gave him money for his sixty years in service. But we know that but is a that lie. Is not, that is not. They true. cannot kidnap you to say, "Oh, yeah. we kidnap you." Oh, make a video. Then this is money for sixty years. In, I mean, how many years 16 in service? Sixteen years. Sixteen years in no. service. But we are not. We are not talking to children, Baba. We have collected twenty-eight million. In twenty-eight million, you are going to buy. That one. means he was giving the money to shut up. To shut up now. That's bribery. That's bribery. That one, I just want to be sure. That's bribery. The money is for him to shut up. 
Let us close. Thank you very much, guys, for watching this episode. Shout out to Solomon for doing a fantastic job. You know, we have our differences, but we will commend you when you do well. Yes. Uh, you did. You try. You try. Uh -huh. So thank you for bring, putting this out. Mike Davis is Ogun that will fire you. Ogun. So you, we have people like that plenty. They will come and use platform like this. Hey, help us talk about this. They will write us. Talk about this. Talk about this. To put somebody in trouble. Mm. By the time you going to talk now, it's you that lawyer will be pursuing about. Then they will be in their house. On Yoshi. We don't even want to. We, don't worry. Don't worry. We'll have your time. Just continue this rubbish. Thank you guys for watching. That's good. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. My life. May I follow him on Instagram. My Jandisha Comedian. And follow us on all our social media handles at Nigeria's Craziest. Before I even forget, there's this African story. No, no talking, you rubbish. We don't close. Close up. Let's go to the rubbish. Thank you guys for watching this episode. And then uh, we'll see you on the next episode. Don't forget, we have our merchandise on this spring. Go there and buy. Don't forget, you can become a Patreon for a little as $1 to as much as $1,000. Don't forget, question everything because normal is boring. Thank you.